Federal party leaders were among those condemning protests at hospitals across the country Monday. The protest organizers oppose measures taken to stop the spread of COVID-19 and invited people to what they called silent vigils at locations including the Ottawa Hospital. The Liberals said they would introduce legislation that would criminalize obstructing access to any building providing health services, as well as intimidating or threatening healthcare professionals providing medical care or Canadians receiving that care. It is not okay that across the country, hospitals are having to put up barricades today to manage the mobs coming their way. NDP leader Jagmeet Singh expressed his opposition to protest at hospitals at a Monday campaign stop. If you're in any way threatening healthcare workers, impeding their ability to go to work, if you're impeding patients' access to care, if cancer patients aren't being able to get into the hospital, that is just not on. The NDP want to make it a criminal code offence to harass or block someone from accessing health care. These protests, this harassment of our frontline uh, nurses, doctors, is completely unacceptable. Conservative leader Aaron O'Toole tweeted that if necessary, law enforcement should be deployed to prevent people from obstructing access to a hospital. At the Ottawa Hospital Civic Campus, about 50 protesters showed up Monday. They stayed on the sidewalk across from the hospital and didn't attempt to block traffic or harass people going in and out. Taylor Blewett, Post Media.